knowing I'm not back in China, we actually do have a few Gao laws here in Germany. And today I will use this beautiful weather to be outside and talk to you about this book here, the Tianxia, the Dang Dai Sing, which basically means the modern version of the Tianxia system, so the all uh, under heaven system, written from Zhao Dingyang in 2015. It was published and Zhao Dingyang is a Chinese philosopher who actually already in 2006 published his first book about the Tianxia TC, about the all under heaven system and today we will explore this a little bit. And because I could hardly remember all the things which I want to tell you, so I made myself here a small list of notes. Basically these are the quotes out of the book which I think are the most interesting ones. And so I will directly begin with Tianxia shi yi ge guan yu shi jie de zheng zhe li xiang. So Tianxia is so all under heaven is just a system of how to govern the world but it's an ideal view so it's not it, it's basically like an utopia which is very difficult to be reached and yeah he's also speaking of a world of worldliness and order of coexistence he is quoting many persons this starts from Lao Tzu, Guan Tzu, Kong Tzu, also to Marx and uh, Mao Zedong and Kant and Hobbes so it's really interesting and some cool quotes I will tell you now is like Yi Tian Xia Wei Tian Xia so basically from the world from the all under heaven we should govern all under all under heaven or like uh, Tian Xia TC Jiu Zhe Yo Nei Bu Sing A Mei Yo Wai Bu Sing so that under the all under heaven system there's only an inside thinking and there's no thinking of an outside or then let's talk about basically when Tianxia was established so Tianxia uh, was during the Zhou Chao so during the Zhou dynasty in China this was roughly around uh, 1000 before uh, Christus and then until 200 uh, BC I think so it was also 800 years so it's the longest Wang Chao the longest dynasty in China so it was quite successful one can say and there is he also mentions that the Zhengzhe Bi Su Zun Zhong Shi Jie so that the government the, the system needs to respect the world so each actions should follow the respect to the world and Zhao Dingyang says that if we want to create this Tianxia we need to put aside all the feelings of values of what people feel and what they value because each person values different things and we cannot put our personal values onto others so there are no universal values is what Zhao Dingyang says and I just would like to mention a pretty cool thing which I once saw. This is the IFOPE. This is the international flag of planet Earth, which I think once a Swedish guy designed, where there are seven white circles on a blue background and each circle is representing uh, one continent. And I think this is a pretty cool thing and which leads me to these quotes like Da Tong Shi Jie, which basically means like a big united uh, world or big same world probably or then also the Tianxia Wei Gong which is also a very famous idiom which means that the Tianxia all he under heaven is for everyone of course this is a little bit again utopia idealistic but I think it's uh, still a nice uh, thought and or even though there's the even extreme would be Tianxia Yi Guo Yi Jia so Tianxia all under heaven one nation and one family uh, if we really can see each other like this it's difficult but maybe if everyone would act like this this world would be a pretty cool place and then let's talk about what Zhao Dingyang thinks that this system should offer to countries which would like to join and also requirements which would the system have so first of all he writes Gao Hu Lian Wang Dong Dong Chuan Hua the Chuan Li 
So this basically means that the high-end technology and uh, systems like the internet should be controlled and governed by the whole world and not a single state or a yeah, single family in a different case. And then he says that Tianxia uh, TC Bisu Baozheng Ge Guo Jia Ru Tianxia TC the Hao Chu. So there should be advantages and benefits for all countries which would join this system. And these benefits would be like long, uh, endurant peace and harmony. And that also there will be benefits as such as the uh yeah pubian gongxiang singer so that there will be a thing which everyone could enjoy this might be uh he also mentions later uh twenty jinrong si tong so like a a a, a whole world finance uh, system and basically what i think about this it is sounds quite similar to what the european union has tried and this is also some my main, my main thought when I was reading this book. A lot of the things is like what is like what the European Union uh, describes, but only that the European U Union adds values into this, um, because in the U EU you have the you have the not all countries though, but the most countries uh, use the euro. So and they have their personal identity card they only use instead of a passport they can move freely they can work wherever they want in the european union and there are also uh, supranational laws which are being uh, defined to manage the, these countries better and out of my opinion i think it's working because now since 75 years there was no major war in europe which is pretty decent achievement when considering that we once had a 30 years war and uh, a lot of wars in, in Europe though. So as a lot of the theory Zhao Dingyang is using builds on Confucius and Confucius thoughts and ideas, um, let's talk a little bit about what Confucius said. And first of all he says uh, So Confucius is not an idealist, but rather he is a realist. So he takes uh, logic, ideas and uh, frames them in a realistic way. And then he says, so okay, what requirements do we need to yeah, live the Tianxia? And basically during the Zhou Zhao, there was a Tianxia and two other things. There was De Zhe, so there was the Confucian idea of a rule of virtue which you need to uh, to uh, know to form your government uh, rules and then the second one would be Hersia. so Deutsche and Hersia, where Hersia means harmony and coordination so this will be about Ruhe Xingzheng Xingzheng uh, Hezua so how to work together so you need the Confu uh, Confucian values and a way of coordination and then you can live the Tianxia system. And Zhao Dingyang is also talking about the Kongzi Gaishan. So this means that basically if you have two persons and one person is already behaving better towards you and towards the rest of the world, then you have already gained something. So everyone should uh, better its individual in order to also have a better world. I think this is what he describes by the Kongzi Gaishan. And Zhao Dingyang further is talking about a lot about the Di Guo Zhou Yi and its uh, impacts on uh, the life uh, of the on the time be, uh, after it. So Di Guo Zhou Yi is imperialism, and he quotes that in two th uh, 1914, Western countries. Uh, ruled over 84% of the world and he also said that the Di Guo Zhu Yi Shi Jie Guan Ba Shi Jie Kan Cheng Shi Zheng Fu Zhe Pei He Lu Bo De Dui Xiang Song Lai Meo Xiang Dao Zong Shi Jie Chu Si Kao So he says that in the imperialist 
we're just dominating others and uh, exploiting them and never really thought about how to get like how to think from the world up on but they were just th uh, uh, thinking about themselves and he's also in the end talking about I think another interesting topic this is the Pax Zinica which uh, William A. Callahan once mentioned is the Zhongguo Zheng Zhongguo Zhe Xia Zhe He Ping so yes uh, where he said that where Callahan uh, says or raises the doubt that the system would it be ruled under Asia uh, or uh, I mean under China and this is just uh, another yeah huge topic he's uh, opening here and but I would say that that this is it is for this video because it's uh, long enough I think and uh, I would recommend this book uh, for everyone who is interested in the Chinese language because there are many short uh, sentences but also more complex ones and I think it's an interesting thing to go through but it's not a really funny book or a book which motivates you I think it's a, a little bit uh, depressive to be honest because he said it's just an idea and he doesn't give quite exact ways of how we can achieve this kind of Tian Xia uh, idea but uh, it was interesting though and keep tuned and I wish you the best see you again